Hello, welcome to my review of Invincible on Amazon Prime, an animation series for adults. Yeah, 18 plus. This is not for kids, okay? Even though it's animation. This is going to be a spoiler review. So if you haven't seen it, maybe you should before you sit down and watch the rest of this review. That being said, I waited until the fourth episode drop before I start to sit down and watch because I just want to see if it's worth binging, okay? And the fact that I finished the first four episodes in one sitting, good news, right? I wouldn't waste my time if I didn't like it, but it did take me a little bit to get going because even though I'm aware of the comic books, I have never flipped through the comic books, so I am not familiar with any of this storyline or the, this universe or any of the characters so it took me a while to get warm up to the characters but by the end of the first episode what really got my attention is of course omni-man and what he did to the team right so that was right <laughs> didn't expect that coming maybe that's from the comic books i'm guessing for those that read the books but that caught me by surprise the level of chaos and violent got me there and at that point I couldn't help but think that man if they have a bigger budget this could have been another series that that had the kind of violence like the boys you know how the other superhero series from Amazon that is ultra violent but fun to watch this this had a similar feel after the very first episodes and no doubt about it the series it's about the Grayson family, centered around the young Grayson, learning about his power, learning about how to use his power, learning how to adapt to society with his new power, his girlfriend, all of that. But to me, what's most interesting is Omni-Man. I want to know more about what the heck is going on there. So to me, he's the star of the series. I don't know about what other people think about you know the series. Um, as far as the superheroes, if you're familiar with, you know, what reading, watching superhero movies or comic books, it's nothing really, you know, mind blowing about their power, their costume, or any anything like that. To me, it's it's about the story, okay? It's not about what kind of power they have and all that. It's 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 secondary. It's all about the story here, and so far the story got my attention. And I'm guessing this is gonna be a uh, eight episode series for season. So we're halfway there. I look forward to see how Omni Man pan out in the next four episodes. And that's my review of Invincible on Amazon Prime. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.